After a long and difficult stretch on the road, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers are back home this Sunday, so that means it's time for Gridiron Grub. Finally, they're back, yeah. and that means executive chef Jason is back with us to have a twist on comfort food as the Bucks get ready to battle the Cardinals. Of course, we're talking about the big game on Sunday, so I know you've got a big dish here for parent too, right? Oh, Jason? yes, yes. Well, so today we're doing Ropa Vieja grilled cheese. Uh, nice little twist on the uh, on the classic Cuban dish. Yeah, uh, it's one of the sandwiches we do. We do three different kinds of press sandwiches. Of course, the traditional Cuban sandwich, okay. a ropa via via grilled cheese, and then a veggie Cuban. So is this something so that's on the, the menu every home game? It is. Do yeah, okay. available at the Taste of Tampa's and and throughout the stadium in a few locations. So. So have you just been on vacation the last couple of weeks, <laughs> I, like doing I nothing, sitting on the couch? Wish. I certainly <laughs> wish. No, we've been really busy <laughs> getting ready for this game. Yeah. And we're back to back with the Bulls. So, it, you know, we're, we are very busy this You're week. You're making up for uh, yes. lost time here. And we've got over 3,000 Cubans to make just this week to get ready. how many you make just oh, this yeah. week? Yeah, for one game, we do about 3,000 Cubans for, for, wow. for a game. Wow. So. Wow. Okay, we'll get started. Okay. So, so we can we, make, we, make one, So, so we, two. We put the recipe for the Ropa Vieja online okay. uh, on the website. Um, and today we're going to just do a nice little twist on it. So these are this is great. You can do, do this in a slow cooker at home, get it ready overnight. So, you know, for these day games, there it's an early start. Okay. Folks are coming over the house around 10, right? Um, so it's a great idea to do this the night before, get it going. So it's, you know, it's beef, you it's put chili, in the, okay, this. beef, chilies, garlic, tomatoes, uh, spices, a little bit of cilantro. Yeah, pep, chili peppers in there, red and green. Um, so, it, you know, it, it normally comes out pretty moist. So we drain it a little bit to make the sandwiches so they're not too sloppy. Okay. Um, a nice variation on this would be we could drop an egg in and, uh, and scramble that. So if you've got folks coming over early at like 10 a.m., you can make a little uh, like a breakfast version of it by scrambling whoa, whoa, whoa. an you egg. You scramble in. the egg in the meat right, right into there? The meat. Right into the meat. Okay. Right? And I then just you. scramble it up and, and, and make a nice little beef and egg sandwich, uh, grilled cheese style. Uh, but we'll, we'll just do the basic grilled cheese okay. today, the, the Ropa Vieja grilled cheese. Um, so we've got, uh, we've got our classic Cuban bread. Okay. Uh, uh, sliced sharp cheddar and a mustard and mayo mix, which is really classic with the Cubans. And this is how it's actually served at and the stadium, right? And this is actually okay. how it's served at the stadium. Like I said, the egg would just be a nice little variation okay. at home for your, for your friends coming over early for the game. We've always got that one friend that shows up early. <laughs> uh, that's never me. Not at all. I was going to say, all. that's not Natalie. So, so we've, got, we've got butter in our pan. We've built out the sandwich nice and, nice and tight, and then we're just going to toast it. Most of us don't have a sandwich press at home like yeah. they do in the Cuban shops. Yeah. So if you just take your spatula and press it down a little bit, you can hear that nice little sizzle and it presses the sandwich out. Your friends would never know that you didn't go to the Cuban shop. Bread's important, it though. It I is. will say. I mean, that's kind of what makes up. And people here in the, in the Bay Area are picky about their bread. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. I like the fact that you're uh, giving some love, too, to the vegetarian over there. That's a colorful sandwich that keeps catching my eye. Yeah, it's all seasonal vegetables, squashes, roasted red peppers, some pickled tomatoes. Instead of using the dill pickle that you oh, normally okay. see on a Cuban oh, sandwich, yeah. we pickled tomatoes for the, for the veggie Cuban. Um, we use an avocado mayo for that one. Uh, but it does have cheese, but we can take that off if you're vegan and we can certainly accommodate you in that way. So All right. it's a great little, uh, th there are several options for the press sandwiches. So once you get this going, it's just a matter of melting that cheese and getting a really nice little toast on the outside of that bread. We do good. a lot of grilled cheeses. We do the same kind of bad boy with the grilled cheeses in our house. <laughs> Not just for my daughter, my child <laughs> too, let's be honest. We've got a gorgeous little grilled cheese here. All right. I love this, that you're taking something simple, you kind of add some pizzazz to it, add some Tampa flair to it, and of course you can get it at the Bucks game. Where exactly. more to get Tampa yeah. flair exactly. than a Bucks game? And for all those Arizona fans, and, and next week with uh, New Orleans, fans. that's Just right, we don't care, but we want them to taste Tampa while they're <laughs> that's here. That's right, so. exactly. That is something, did you keep that in mind? Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. You know, we want them to eat Tampa. We don't, you know, we don't serve fajitas at yeah, their game, uh -huh. but we, we, we serve Tampa food, so. That's awesome, right. I never even put the two together. Well, good stuff, I know you're yeah. busy, but please come back and see us. Absolutely. I'm liking these segments. I, I know. think this is a fun way to, uh, to you make them, Chef. Love. No, thank you so much. This is great. Thank you, Chef Jason. All and right. uh, there's the information so you can go and cheer on the bucks as well and get your hands on one of these Cubans as well. Take care.